Here we have Justin Rodriguez, 2021, the Indy Pro winning version. The guy was very impressive, very impressive. He had size, condition, and he defeated a lot of good bodybuilders. Now fast forward just one year later, the exact same event, similar lineup besides Charles Griffin, but similar lineup, similar lineup, and he places fourth. So what happened in that one year to Justin Rodriguez? Did he drop the ball? First of all, this video is not meant to, to, to diss my man Justin. I mean, Justin Rodriguez, one of my favorite bodybuilders. It's just strange that from one year he places first and then down to, to fourth. The exact same event. Now, I guess you could... Compare the two versions, 2021 to 2022. What a year, or what a difference one year can make in bodybuilding. Or does it? Do the places reflect this guy's shape, condition? He looks just as good in the upper body, aside from, of course, a little bit of separation in the abs. You can definitely see that. You can definitely see that. His arms, the, the tricep sweeps, they might be a little bit more separated back in 2021, but I don't know. I don't know. Lighting's a little bit different. The lats look uh, maybe bigger last year, but it, then again, it's very difficult to say. Now, this is where it gets confusing. Look at his quads. You see that? I wager to say Justin Rodriguez has improved these two versions. Look, you can see the outer quads. Both legs, both legs. I mean, the conditioning... It's up for debate with, you know, muscle separation, things of that nature. But man, this is, this is a little bit different than I thought it was going to be. Let's go to the front lat spread. Now here is where I see 2021 much better. Look at the delts, look at the chest, the lats themselves. You can see midsection is smaller and that's the upper body. Look at the wheels again. Look at the legs, guys. Justin Rodriguez, and like I said, this is not meant to diss my man Justin. I mean, this is a kudos to Justin Rodriguez. I just think that he was competing a little bit too much. I mean, he was competing against a pretty stiff lineup at the Boston, at the Arnold Classic. The guy's been competing a lot, a lot. Maybe take a break, hmm, and uh, I don't know. Side chest development, same thing here. Same thing here. He looks bigger. He looks bigger now than he did last year, in particular in those wheels. But he had he has some more conditioning in the the quads and the glutes. You can see from last year. But look at the upper body. Look at the upper body here. It looks much better this year. Look at the tricep. Look at the delts. I mean, my soul, my soul, my soul. So if you're looking for a video that shows the deterioration of Justin Rodriguez, look again. Of course, the back development. The back development is iffy. This is definitely iffy. The condition is what the judges were looking for, I think, is why he did place. A little bit lower here. You can see the hamstrings, not as peeled. The glutes, most certainly not as diced. But look at the size of the quads, even from behind. His legs are bigger. Even the, uh, the hamstrings, you can see, they're, they're almost touching each other. You can see, but the back, maybe he's just not flexing properly. I don't know. I don't know. I like Justin. I'd like to see him improve rear double bicep. And yeah, I think honestly that his back was better last year, but that's just could be a conditioning issue. I mean, you get a little bit more conditioned. The, the Christmas tree pops out a little bit better and the Latin insertions are more prominent. But ladies and gentlemen, pan back. I mean, you even have the same background here with the Indy. Look at his quads from behind. You tell me. And even in the calves. You tell me. Does this look like a bodybuilder that has improved? I would wager to say yes. I just honestly think it was a condition issue. Turn around here. And this one here. Look at the lower quads. Wow. Wow. This is impressive. So for those of you who thought, geez, Justin, 
He's fading away. He's going to nothing. No, 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 no. It was a condition issue. Guy has improved tenfold. I mean, this this is a, a guy who we never really criticized his lag size before. And his wheels are looking even bigger. And if you ask me, in this comparison, his abs look sharper as well. But that's not... The 2021 abs and thigh was in a lineup. I don't think he was ready for the shot itself. But take it for what it is. Most muscular, most certainly the last say on this one. I mean, what, what are you going to tell me? That he's, he's not getting better? I think he is. I think he is. Look at the legs. Much bigger, much bigger. Even some calf development. Upper body, very similar. And, and a couple of those shots. Side ch- uh, chest, I think it was. There was no side tricep pose from last year, by the way. But yeah, his tricep looked bigger in certain shots. And his arms look more separated. Uh, they do here, even. They do here, even. Chest looks good, both versions. So Justin Rodriguez, I mean, why did he play so low? If he looks just as good, maybe even better in the wheel department. It's bodybuilding, guys and girls, and condition counts big time. And this is not a cherry-picked, poopy-picked bad pitcher of 2022. This is his Christmas tree. And look at how crisp his tree was last year. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. There's your difference. There's your difference. So get those shreds back he had last year and keep the size on those wheels. I mean, even in this picture, you can see undeniable couple of inches on those quads. A little bit of a midsection sticking out there as well. But anyway, guys, like I said, Justin Rodriguez, one of the nicer guys in bodybuilding. I mean, hey, sky's the limit for him if he's improving like this in the wheel department, which I think he is. Just take a little bit more time off and I guess he's going to try to compete or you know, qualify for the Olympia. So we'll probably see him at the New York Pro as well. Hit thumbs up on the video, subscribe to the channel. Have a good day.